Scotland vs Republic of Ireland 1-0. A Sean Maloney goal of the very highest quality earned Scotland a precious and hard-fought victory over the Republic of Ireland. From a short corner, Malone squeezed the ball into the feet of Scott Brown, whose back heel allowed the winger to curl an exquisite shot home. It was a moment of rare class in a game that lived up to its derby billing. There was a late scare for Scotland as Grant Hanley's header came back off his own bar, but, unlike in Germany, there was to be no late equaliser for Ireland. The result draws Scotland level with their opponents on seven points after four games in Group D, with both Poland and Germany winning handsomely. Dropped points would have meant Scotland slipping further off the pace, as it is. Both countries trail the pace-setting polls by three points but retain strong hopes of automatic qualification for Euro 2016. Former Celtic manager Martin O'Neill had spoken of his belief that his Irish side could win on his return to Celtic Park. Instead, it was his successor at the club, Gordon Strachan, who enjoyed the happier homecoming. Another of the pre-match talking points was the expected booing of the Scots-born Ireland winger. Aidan Majidi and his reception was suitably hostile, he was treated by the home fans as the pantomime villain. From the outset, the pace of the game was frenetic, the tackling was tenacious and, at times, downright careless, leading to early bookings for Hanley, Majidi and his Ireland teammate. Jeff Hendrick, the passion on show almost made up for the dearth of football, with precious few chances created in the opening half hour. John Walters and Darren Gibson did force David Marshall into saves, but there was little to worry either goalkeeper, 